It appears now that San Antonio police have two down and one to go when it comes to arrests in connection with a capital murder case. U.S. Marshals Lone Star Fugitive Task Force announcing the arrest of one suspect late last night. And we have learned police have taken another man into custody and may be looking for a third suspect. Katrina Weber tells us they're accused of killing a man and woman found inside a burning home two weeks ago. From the start, it was clear that the fire that broke out July 7th inside an apartment in the 900 block of Waverly Avenue was no ordinary case. Right after the flames were out, San Antonio police moved in and later announced that the man and woman found dead there were victims of a murder. Late last night, members of the U.S. Marshals Lone Star Fugitive Task Force made an arrest, taking 24-year-old Juan Antonio Reyes into custody at a nearby motel. They say a thorough investigation led them to him in the 1400 block of Culebra Road. The people here at this motel didn't have much to say at all about the arrest, but I did speak with a repairman who says he was called in to fix the door of the suspect's room, which had been broken down. An arrest affidavit offers new details about the case, including that the victims both were shot in the head. Relatives identified them as 39-year-old Sergio Soto and his aunt, Rachel Martinez. The affidavit says surveillance cameras captured video of three suspects. With help from family members, police identified two, Reyes, who was related to the victims, and 24-year-old John Bishop Torres, who also was arrested last night. These mugshots are from previous arrests, but this time, both men face capital murder charges. Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News.